Hello, thank you for joining me today. I'm Kathy Baker and I wanted to share today a catalog kickoff. I recently did a Facebook session and it came out rather digitized so I wanted to share online with YouTube just in case you had tried to see it there. So let me start out by showing you the new catalog cover. This is a <clears throat> The new catalog goes 2020 through 2021, and I wanted to show this first stamp set that's on the cover. It's called Lovely You, and it is right here. And one of the things that I really love about it is they've taken these little stamps in this particular sample and made what looks like designer paper, but they just stamped it, and it looks really, really pretty. I have a couple of samples that I shared. They are... <coughs> designs that were from another stamper named Lissa Zwolanek and she lives in uh, I think she lives in Wisconsin I may get that wrong but anyway these are cards that I made um, based on samples that she had provided and just took this little leaf and made it into a wreath and stamped the little flowers and fussy cut them and I love the sentiment miles apart but still in my heart and this one, also simple stamping where you're just using inks and paper. The only thing I added to this one was the little bit of linen thread and some dimensionals to pop everything up. But I really like this set and how just the beautiful cards you can make with it. Another one <clears throat> that I wanted to share is called Ornate Gardens. And I'm going to be showing some... Uh, I'm going to go back and forth in the catalog because I really wanted to highlight things in a certain order. Ornate Gardens, I recently did um, a mailing kit that I've started this program and I used the, some of the papers from this particular set and we made two cards and they were a lot of fun. The mailing kit is something that I started because of the whole COVID thing and people not being able to meet in person. So. Um, I provided all of the supplies and I just do that once a month and for $12 you get all of the supplies sent to you in the mail and you get to we do a zoom session so everybody can put the cards together and be with each other this particular product suite is called flowers for every season and it has um, beautiful flowers in it I wanted to show you the paper it's a stack of uh, that's a six by six so there are 12 different papers, and you can see there's some that are Christmassy, like the poinsettias, and then fall and springish, and just in summer, it's got all four seasons in there, and then the backs are rather muted. But I really love these papers, and they're <clears throat> you can make some really cute cards that are so simple. I just took the papers and did a little swatch with them, and these particular colors, this is one of the new in colors. This is Magenta Madness, I think, and Just Jade, and Misty. Mm, it's not Marina Mist, but it's Misty something or other. I'm sorry, I should know that. We'll know it before that session ends. Um, but simple cards to make just using these papers and the new in colors. You can make a lot of cards really quickly. It's very, very easy. Another one of the sweets that I like a lot is called This World of Good. It has some really beautiful papers. I am all about papers. I love them. It's really fun. One of the things in this new catalog is the these little circles. Every time you see designer paper within a suite, all these little circles show you the different colors of cardstock that match with that suite. In this World of Good and match these papers. The World of Good suite, there's some really good stamp sets for men. I know sometimes people say, we don't have enough men sets. This is one that came out last year, but these two sets are new, The Game On and Campology. They're page 28 and 29 when you get a new catalog in your hands. Another suite is this Playful Pets. I thought this was so cute, and I love the fact that <clears throat> there are stamps and punches and dies. So we already had um, a cat punch, and there is now also a dog builder punch. The cat punch, it's teeny tiny here, but it's page 167. You can see them full size, the dog builder punch. But also this particular set has die cuts available for these particular stamps. So just really fun. If you have pets, this is a great set. The next suite I wanted to show you is a whale of a time. I love this one. Just so pretty. Now it's got, you know, the pretty um, 
different ocean life. But these colors are so vibrant. I just couldn't get over how luscious they are. So I wanted to share that with you. This is my favorite suite of the whole catalog. It's called Forever Greenery. And these papers are so beautiful. All of the different greens. I mean, six different shades of green. There's uh, the Pretty Peacock is an in color that was brought in last year that is... Um, only good for one more year, but then Just just Jade is the new one. This suite has all of these pretty uh, papers, and then it's got this wonderful stamp set with all of the ferns. I love the fact that these two stamps are the same thing, but facing different directions. And then, of course, it has the die cuts that fit it all. I did some samples that were designed by a woman named... Um, Oh, I have it written down. Heidi Collins and using simple stamping. So she did this stamp set in those five or six colors that were listed here and came up with this card. And I love the fact that it's just stamps, ink, and paper. Really, really pretty. And then another thing that she did was she did a watercolor wash. She took um, ink and put it on the clear clip clear acrylic block and then spritzed it with a little water till the colors ran and then stamped the block right on the paper. Look at the just the colors that you get by stamping that block on there. And then this one I just added a little bit more embe embellishments. In this particular suite there's this gold braid that comes unraveled. Uh, I mean you can fray it on the ends and I just love that look. It's just really fine and delicate. Also part of the suite are some gold foil embellishments. This is one of the papers and there's also some embossing folders. So this was really a sweet thing to be able to make. Another part of the gold foil papers was th these little squares and all I did was I took the different colors and I did a half inch strip of each one of those colors on a piece of cardstock that I cut the same size as the gold foil. So I mounted the little stripes of cardstock and then I put the gold on top of it. And I just used the Tombow liquid for that. So this sweet forever greenery. I absolutely love it. And I love it so much I had to show you the actual papers because you can see them in your catalog but I wanted you to see them in a little bit bigger picture here. They're just so luscious and lovely. I hope everybody enjoys them as much as I do because I just couldn't get enough of them. Another stamp set that is in the mail for me, it hasn't arrived yet, is this stamp set called Nothing's Better Than. And I just think it is so cute because it's got cookies and chocolate and coffee and cocktails and then all of these little sayings. I like this, a day without coffee is like, um, just kidding, I have no idea. And things like um, chocolate because adulting is hard, you know, today's plan, consume cookies and be awesome. You know, anyway, just some really cute little sayings, really cute stamps. I can't wait to get my hands on that one and just share it. It also comes with a die cut set. The die cuts have these, the big words, cookies, uh, let's see, cookies and chocolate and love you more than and cocktails and coffee are the words that come in script uh, in the die cuts. So you can see this word cocktails is dimensional and you can do that and you can use your uh, adhesive paper to cut that out on your big shop. This stamp set is called Tasteful Touches. It was one of those sets that I went, do I really need another flower stamp set? But I thought, yes I do because I'm always saying you are the best to, to everybody I know. And I just love hello cards for anybody. And then I saw some samples made with it. You know, I love the background stamp. And so I saw a sample that was made that actually used some designer paper that I did not have. And so what I did was I took the sample that they did and instead of designer paper on the top, I used this background stamp to kind of make my own designer paper. Then there's some more of the gold elements and I stamped the flower and uh, stays on black and then I used my watercolor pencils. Isn't that fun? I just love how pretty that is. And then Mary Fish is really good about doing things that are simple. I love the fact that this is another one of those cards that's basically just stamps, ink, and paper using this flower. Her original, she used poppy red, was a little bit more orange, um, but I went ahead and I used real red. And then the good things in life are better with you. And this is actually linen thread that I used my marker to make it match the gray and just kind of ran my marker along the thread. And then just uh, one more thing I wanted to be sure and show you the new in colors. 
um, so so pretty just jade uh, the yellow is called bumblebee the brownish one is called cinnamon cider uh, magenta madness and then the blue I need to make sure and see it, is actually called misty moonlight that's what it's called and I saw this card made using all of these in colors with the um, scrappy strip technique that's a hard word for me to say altogether anyway I just wanted to share these highlights with you from the new catalog and let me know if you need a catalog or if you want to place an order you can go to my website and I hope that you've enjoyed this video with the highlights of the new Stampin' Up! annual catalog come again thanks